This is a 1,000 gallon septic tank. It's four lines, 50 foot each. It's about seven tons of rock in each one. Pitching with the slope of the land. Four days of work. Let's hope it passes inspection. Trenches are about 24 to 30, some areas 36. Here's the bridge I used. Number 57 rock. Big pieces. That's what we're looking for. Don't recommend anybody does this by themselves like I did. The only thing that justifies the labor is the cost. So this cost me about $2,300 with the rocks, fabric, septic, all the pipes. They wanted $7,000 to put one of these in. But it was absolute hell. Now I got to backfill it on Monday if it passes, which it should. Because it's all pitched. Pitched back to here. I think it was five trips in that trailer, about six tons at a time. And the rest, whatever little bit was left, I would just put in the road once the machine couldn't scrape it out. Which, real quick, to end this video, I'll show you what I used to do all this work. I don't know how it's still running after the abuse I just put it through. This guy, right here. Fresh wash. This machine, as crappy as it may look, is a beast. <laughs> this machine's made me at least $100,000 since I've owned it in the last two, three years. Three years? Two years, three, two and a half. So anyway, that's that. Kind of a mess. <laughs>